Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me, and welcome back to Atlas, everybody, where last night we spent nine and a half hours in a stream doing a bunch of building, and so we're going to go ahead and get rid of most of this. This is an update on the base, guys, just to let you know what's going on. We're just going to hang out for today. I'm not going to show you anything. We're not going to build it. I'm not going to build anything. I'm not going to, there's no tutorials. There's no how-tos. This is just me talking to you. Me talking to you about what's going on with the uh, with the build. So anyway, guys, all this right here has been placeholder. The entire thing has been placeholder. So I think I said it before, but I'm going to say it again. None of this was meant to be permanent. And so, I mean, there's some people thinking that, that I was just, you know, we're just, I'm just a casual player. And whatever. We are on Twitch Twitch RP, um, the server, and that it's filled with YouTubers and streamers, and including Mr. Moon, if you know who he is, and his crew, the household, a lot of the household is here. So, you know, I mean, we it's filled with not, not casual players. And I have 6,500 hours in ARC, so, you know, I know what I'm doing, and I have a, I, there is a method to my madness. So for those of you who don't have faith, have faith. Because um, this is this is this is going somewhere. Anyway, we spent nine and a half hours last night building this. I built up to the top of this mountain, to the top of this mesa here, and this this little gate right here. It's not going to be able to get through an elephant or, or or a rhino can't get through here either because those are large animals. So that'll go away eventually. This is just to keep the scrubs out um, of going up and putting their nose in my business. Anyway, we put this platform here, walled all this here, and then I built all the way up. All the way up. There's another platform on, up here. This was a lot of stone. This was a lot of wood. This was a lot of thatch. Anyway, I went all the way up. And this is built so I can build or bring an elephant up or a rhino up. So eventually we can have all of our animals up here. I'm going to go tame those animals here next week probably. And to let you know, I am going to edit uh, the, all the footage for the, from the streams. And I'm going to go ahead and make a, make a build montage so you guys can see what, what it took to build this. There's another platform at the top here, so that's a third platform that I made, or that we made. And uh, Monogard, my gaming partner, she made this house over here. I'm pretty pretty proud of her. She did a really good good job. Let me go. But before I show you that, we're going to show you this. There's a fourth platform right here, which uh, you can see you can overlook the water line. You can overlook the coastline, and we're probably going to put mortars and cannons on this lower edge down here down here is going to be uh, filled with mortars and cannons it's because i talked with some cannoneers and some people in, uh, in another company and they and they said oh yeah you could absolutely mortar the crap out of a fleet of ships from up here and it's going to be super hard for them to get up here i mean climbing picks and grappling hooks being what they are climbing picks, picks, picks and grappling hooks could get you up here pretty quick but once i'm done it's going to be really super hard to siege this place it's gonna be super difficult. So, anyway, let's look at Monogar's house right quick. Monogar, Monogar did an amazing job. I'm super proud of her. She, uh, she did a three-story, a couple of porches right here. This is a role-play server as well as a PvP server, so you know we we, we role-play pretty hard here. And when the PvP happens, it happens pretty hard too. So, uh, we we want things to be as aesthetic, aesthetically pleasing as possible. So you got a little back porch action happening here. We got you know the main room, we got the front porch. Go upstairs. Second story, second front porch, and then third story. And there's a second back porch right here. And then third story up top. I don't know what she's gonna do with this attic. I don't know where she's gonna place all this stuff, all the crafting. I don't know where the crafting area, I don't know if it's going to be up top or not, um, where the kitchen's going to be, bedrooms, you know, for spawning and whatnot. But I'm super proud of her. She did a really good job. I'm super happy with the build. So, yeah, I hope you guys like that. We're going to drop down here. I'm going to show you a little bit more of the, uh, before the sun goes down real quick, I'm going to show you a little bit more of the uh, the benefit of this this mesa top or this bluff. If I drop down, I don't think I'm going to do any damage. Yeah, we're good. All right, so all this right over here. There's a lot of vantage points here, and once I build out a little bit, I don't know if I'm going to build out or not. These these platforms have 85,000 health, right? Yeah, 85,000 health. So they're you know they're okay, but this is a permanent rock. This can't be destroyed. So I'll have to figure out 
what the best way is to be able to hit any ships that might be coming close to shore because I, I can look out right on the shoreline. So I should be able to just bombard the crap and any ships that, that, that come in to the water line or even come close. So, yeah, so I don't, I'm not too worried. Once they get on shore, that's a whole different story. We actually are allied with this trading company that's over here. Let me show you. Not this guy right here, but there's a trading company. They're out of render distance. You can't hardly see. Uh, there's a boat there, right there before the, the coastline goes wraps around to the right. Anyway, there's a big trading company right there that we were allied with. And then tonight on twitch.tv slash myusualme, we're going to go and meet the Emperor Napoleon. Emperor Neon, Neo. And he has a huge group of French soldiers on, just, over that, or just over those mountains right there. And he's invited the entire island. So if you guys want to see a big group of people and a whole bunch of alliances being made, tonight's the night over on twitch.tv slash myusualme. You should come out and check it out because we are, I, I'm going to go live at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time because at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is when the meeting's going to happen. Everybody that's anybody that wants to be an allied on this island is going to be. So we're going to all join together and fight the pirates so we're getting ready, and the, the big RP um, spectacular is going to happen tonight. So we're, we're going to have that giant that giant meeting, and we're going to see what's going to go on. So we were invited to it. Um, my character as the leader of my group has been has been invited to it. I hope you guys will join us. I hope you come see us. 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is when I'm going to start, and who knows when we're going to end. I don't know. It's going to get dark in a second, but real quick, I'm going to show you. People come up the stairs. It's a perfect spot to snipe the shit out of them. Look at that. Oh, my God. It's amazing. I'm so excited about this spot, guys. Anyway, so for those of you who think I'm just a casual player, think again. Because we got we got a lot in store for you for this next for this season in Atlas. And it's gonna be a long season. We're talking months, maybe years, because this thing's gonna be in development for two years, guys. So it's not going anywhere. But once all the building is done, then I have more time to do other games. So just bear with me. We're going to be getting back to other games like Fallout 76 and all those other uh, neat games and the Green Hell and all those other games that you guys are you love on my channel. So don't worry. Don't worry. They haven't gone anywhere. But a lot of them haven't done a lot of uh, updates. I know 76 just had an update, so uh, but it wasn't anything major. There were a couple of glitches and fixes and, and, and some balancing done, but there wasn't anything huge. So that's why you haven't heard anything about, about 76, uh, that, that, that patch. I haven't bothered. Because um, there's not much to say. Anyway, guys, I hope you liked the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And if, as I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Thank you for watching, guys. We'll see you tonight on Twitch. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.